today's video. I do apologize about the cicadas in the background. I live in Australia and this is just the sound I hear from any time of daytime to really when it goes dark at night. <laughs> you get used to it, but it is really annoying in my videos and I do apologize for that. But with that being said, let's get on to the video. Today I want to talk about how to avoid being scammed in the reborn world. Now most scammings happen when you are purchasing a new reborn baby and that can be from a website, that can be from a person, or that can just be like receiving the wrong thing or not receiving anything at all. So let's just start with the basics. If you're purchasing online and you want to use a website, do not use any websites other than the approved websites. The main approved website is Reborns.com. Any YouTuber that you see will specify that. There are a few little uh, people that have nursery, report, uh, nursery websites. I don't know what they are, but I may be able to link them in here. But most of the people that are artists or have nurseries have their pages on Facebook or on Instagram. They maybe even have a YouTube channel as well. So don't buy, like I have, <laughs> I have a video that is posted and I'm sure it will happen to this one as well. People don't watch the whole video or they watch the video and they still ask me, is this website safe? No, it's not safe. None of them are unless I have specifically said it out of my mouth and said this is a safe website. I will not say a website unless I know 1000% that it is 100% safe. So I, it is what it is. <laughs> To avoid scams, a lot of scams are run on those crappy websites and they basically have these beautiful photos that are stolen photos, they are called the prototype photos. So basically when that kit was made, now a kit is the head, the arms and the legs, that kit has been reproduced by someone out there that's stolen the work from the artist that has created it and they have made the head, the arms and the legs again and then they've added awful hair to it, they've added awful paint to it and it's just not the same doll. Plus it's made out of toxic and harmful chemicals inside the paints and inside the vinyl. And they also list them as silicon vinyl and silicon vinyl is not a thing. Silicon and vinyl does not mix together. To avoid being scammed, make sure that you check the artist's reputation, check the reviews. Don't buy off a random website that you think, oh this is cheap, I'm going to buy from there. Reborn kits start from this price and go right up to this price. Now, how can you buy a fully completed doll for this price? when you haven't even had an artist do any work to it. No paint, no hair, no weighting being added, no stuffing being added, no body added. It's just not possible. So I recommend that if you're wanting to buy your first Reborn, have a look on Facebook, jump on the Reborn sell pages. Sometimes there's Reborns for sale under $200 or under $300 or whatever. The bracket is but sometimes there is cheaper options and when you see one for sale or if you put up a post and say look I'm looking for a baby that has open eyes, closed eyes, uh, that wears zero to three month clothes, that I don't know has pink hair, no, <laughs> I don't know whatever you want your baby to have <laughs> and people can say oh I've got this one for sale. You say okay I need a safety photo you also can ask the sellers for certain photos, so 
Do you have like a fork that you can put in the baby's hand? Do you have, can you put a cup on the baby's head? Can you uh, show me a photo with the baby completely undressed and on its uh, belly laying face down? Just a random photo that the seller can do with any household object. Can I see a can of Coke in the baby's in, in the baby's lap? Uh, so that it, you can prove, sorry, so that the seller can prove that they actually have the baby and so that you can see proof that they have the baby, as well as a safety photo. A safety photo is a little piece of paper that is sitting on top of the reborn baby doll in the photo. So it should have the name of the person that's selling it, the date, sometimes it will have what kit the baby is, but as long as it's got the name of the person on their Facebook profile and the date. But just be keep in mind that sometimes people steal photos and also use them. That's why it's a good idea to get that extra photo with the, any household item. Basically they will have to go and take that photo to prove that they have the baby. If something looks too good to be true, it's probably a scam, don't do it. No deal! Like, people say, oh, there's this baby, it was only $50. A kit is like around $50, so you can't get a whole reborn baby for $50, especially if it has rooted hair and lovely painting. It may be a boo-boo baby or something like that, but $50 is still way too little. I would say in Australia you would find a boo-boo baby or a less uh, a new artist starting out uh, creating babies for I'd say like two hundred to three hundred dollars I guess, but you need to convert that for your currency on Google. You can go into Google and you can convert. Uh, 200 or 250 dollars AUD to whatever your currency is so USD pounds whatever it may be and you can see how much that is in your currency but just be really cautious guys I don't want any more people being scammed I don't want any more of these fake babies around and I don't want any more of the artists to quit working there are actually artists that are stopping their work because they're sick of their work being stolen and it's really sad so us that are in the community uh, that are doing everything that we can to make sure that our artists feel loved and that they will continue to sculpt for us because we love these babies so much and we really appreciate their work. I know that it doesn't seem like we do but I am trying to inform as many people as I can so that you guys will be able to do the right thing in the future and if you're saving up for a baby you'll save the extra instead of buying four awful babies and you've already spent the same price on getting one really nice one. You can also search for reborn babies on Gumtree, Marketplace, eBay, possibly Instagram, And of course, the Facebook Reborn for Sale pages. Just be cautious. If you are looking at purchasing a baby and you have joined another Reborn group, feel free to make a post in that group asking, does this seem like it's a legit, uh, does this seem like it's a legit baby for a legit price? And someone, I guarantee, someone will help you out and answer your questions and they'll come and check out the sale for you because we care about the industry. We care about the artists and we would rather the artists stay, stay with us and, you know, we don't want babies that are not the knockoffs being sold. So post about it. There's also some groups called Scammers, Liars, I don't know, whatever they're called, but Reborn Scammer Groups. And a lot of people will post on there and say, hey, has anyone had a transaction with this name, this person? And they'll write their name in. And other people will say, oh, yep, I bought from this person. They look great. Or, oh, yeah, I did purchase for them. It took a little while to get delivered. It wasn't exactly how I was told it was going to be. 
or you know so they will leave a review for that person if they have had uh, communication with them so we all really care and we want to just continue this community on in the correct way without all the knockoff and fake babies. I never used to be as a big advocate as this, but I feel like just in the past few months and maybe in the past year that the knockoffs have gone like from here, like yeah, plodding along, and then all of a sudden it's just gone like this. Like so many knockoffs now, it's so sad, it's awful that someone can just still work like that. And then they call it a reborn baby, and a reborn baby is not a factory painted doll. It is a piece of art that someone has created. Alright, I'm going to stop ranting and end the video here. It's gone on for a little bit longer than I expected. I hope that this video helped you. I really do not want to see any more people get scammed. The reason I make this video is so that people stop getting scammed. The reason most people are getting scammed is because they don't have the information. and where can you get the information? If you type in Reborn Doll on Google or Lifelike Doll on Google, it comes up with all of these scam websites. So how is anyone that doesn't know anything about it to know that there is a scam? So I hope that this just saves, I don't know, 10 people from being scammed. I, I would appreciate if a few more people watched this video and did not get scammed and they didn't purchase a knockoff baby to bring into the Reborn community. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Every like that I get really helps my channel grow and all of my subscribers. I really appreciate you subscribing. Thanks for watching.